The idea of your YouTube video is the most important part of the entire YouTube sales funnel if you want to actually book calls through your YouTube channel. The problem is that most business owners overthink what they should be making videos about, meaning that they get analysis paralysis and don't end up making any videos at all, and as a result, miss out on the best way to book organic calls for your business, which is YouTube. And after working with pretty much every online business niche under the sun, we have over 30 clients, booking them 10 to 30 qualified calls every single month organically through YouTube, we've dialed down the process of coming up with YouTube ideas for our clients. And the important part is they work for literally every niche. So in this video, I'm going to give you that process so you never have to think about video ideas ever again. And at the end, I'll literally give you 25 proven video ideas that you can copy paste into any niche and it will work. So you can steal these ideas. If you make one of these every single week, you'll have videos for the next six months. And I'm giving this to you completely for free. So stick around until the end for that. By the way, if you don't know who I am, my name's Eamon and I'm the founder at TickScale. We work with B2B businesses and online coaches, and we have a ton of directly attributable revenue. So take Eddie Cumberbatch, for example, we took him from 54K a month to over 430K a month. And the best part is that took literally four months. We did this using short form content combined with YouTube. We also work with Dakota Robertson, Simone, Anthony Eclipse, and many more people. So without further ado, let's get right into it. So the first thing we're going to do to come up with video ideas is literally steal from our competitors. And when I say steal, here's what I mean. We're going to find video ideas and concepts that work in other niches and bring them to your channel. So here's a live demo of me doing that in action. So for one of our active clients, Eddie Cumberbatch, I was trying to figure out how we could package a full growth operating course. So what I did is I went and I tried to find one in a different niche. So I took dropshipping. What I did is I typed in the search bar full dropshipping course, I hit enter. And then what came up was this video right here by Jordan Bound. So shout out Jordan Bound. I don't work with him or anything. He had a different thumbnail at the time. His thumbnail looked super similar to this one. So what I did is I literally stole the thumbnail concept and then I took someone else's title framework and tweaked it so it was less than 50 characters, or at least all the important elements were inside the first 50 characters. I made sure to include the growth operating keyword, the word course, and 100% free in brackets and all caps to really hook people in. And this video drove tons of money for Eddie and it still prints to this day. So it was definitely worth it. So just remember your competitors can literally be in any niche. Let's say you're selling a growth operating offer. They don't have to be other growth operators. It can be drop shippers. It can be people selling SMMA biz ops, you name it. But it could also be people in your own industry. Just make sure you're not really copying them. You're sort of using them as inspiration, but then you want to inject your own unique knowledge inside of the video. Okay. So the next way to come up with video ideas is by breaking down your offer or your service into all of the different steps. So what I mean, by this is let's say you're selling a high ticket drop shipping course you know what are the steps to high ticket drop ship okay you need to register the business you need to do market research you need to do supplier research you need to build the store boom 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 we got all the steps so this would fall under action-based content and what this means is it's actionable content we're telling people how to do something how to register their business how to do market research etc etc so all of these are individual youtube videos so if you're making one video a week this is enough content for like two months or two and a half months and then what you can also do is package all of these up into one massive video just like we did for Eddie. Now, real quick, before I get into the title formats, I just want to talk more about the three content buckets. So action-based content, again, this is how to, you know, we're teaching people how to do something. Educational content, this is more like why you need to do X, Y, Z, or for example, maybe we're educating them on why a certain dropshipping product did so well. On the contrary, if we wanted to make this an action-based video, we need to say something like how to find winning dropshipping products. And then not only is the title different, the content is different as well. So in the actionable video, we're telling them the steps to achieve something. And in the educational video, we're more so informing them and teaching them. So the final content bucket that I didn't talk about above is case study breakdowns and client interviews. So this is actually two different things, but it falls under one content bucket, which is social proof. So let's say I made 108K for a client in cash collected, which I did through their YouTube channel in 82 days. I'm going to make a video titled how I generated 108K in cash collected for Daniel Fazio in 82 days through his YouTube channel. Obviously, I'm going to make that way shorter, but you get the gist of it. Now, in terms of the content, I'm literally going to break down all the steps super in depth on exactly what I did. Now, I made a super fat case study breakdown, but the thing is, I haven't made a video on it yet. So I just have this fat Google Doc and this Google Doc freaking printed. If I turn this into a YouTube video, I'd make a ton of money too. And then finally, we have client interviews. So this is super simple. You just want to get on the phone with your client, just like I did right here. So I got my client Daniel on the phone. We talked for 15 minutes. He just said, yeah, he made me 108K. Talk about his experience working with us, so on and so forth. I have a YouTube video that goes over the best questions you should be asking during a client interview. So if you want to see that, it's going to be in the top right hand corner right now. Just click it. Okay, now that we went over the content buckets, let me scroll back up up and go over the templates. So I'm not going to go ahead and read all of these, but I'm just going to break maybe a couple of them down. So this one right here, I mechanism three niches slash models to end result to prove it's not luck. So we did this for one of our clients. His name is Anthony Eclipse. We did it right here. 16K views. I scaled three random dropshipping products to prove it's not luck. 
So, you know, these are just templates you can plug and play into pretty much every niche and they work. So I'm not going to read all these important videos to have on any channel pretty much is a life story video. And then also you just want to make videos that break down pretty much everything you need to do. If I go over to my YouTube channel, I pretty much did the same thing. So right here, this is a case study breakdown. So I'm breaking down how I got this certain result for this certain client. So these are just screen recording videos, me going over results. And then this is an actionable video, but at the same time, it's like a mix of educational because I didn't actually go in Photoshop and show people how to make thumbnails. So this is an educational video because I was just breaking down Joel Kaplan's strategy and I didn't say how to do his strategy. You know what I mean? So this is a client interview. This is an actionable video where I show people how to script out a video. This is an educational video. This is an educational video. This is a client interview. This is pretty much an action based video. This is an action based video. This is a client interview. This is an educational video. This is an educational video. This is an educational video. And then now promoting my coaching program. This is an actionable video, actionable video, actionable video, actionable video, actionable video. And just a heads up guys, I run my agency and I also have a coaching program. Yeah, that's the breakdown of everything. So just screenshot this. I'm gonna do a quick scroll through. So take a screenshot, whatever you need. So that's exactly how to come up with YouTube video ideas for your business so you can book more calls. I literally gave you six months worth of video titles that you can go ahead and steal. So enjoy that. One thing I do want to mention is you probably shouldn't just consistently rip these. You know, you should make your own action based videos and come up with your own ideas. But this is just there to give you a head start. But even if I've given you the titles, there's so much more you have to do to produce a video that books calls on YouTube. You have to write the script, film it, edit it, make the thumbnail, post it. And there's thousands of micro steps that you have to know that I obviously can't cover in this video. But at my agency take scale, we literally do everything for you. So you book 10 to 30 qualified sales calls on autopilot. We do literally all this for you. And all you need to do is film. So if you want 10 to 30 qualified sales calls for your business organically from YouTube, like we've done for Daniel, Simone, Perry, Eddie, etc., then book a call with me right now by clicking the first link in the description. So watch the video on my website and then go through my client interviews and then book a call. You'll talk with me directly and I'll book you calls through YouTube hundred percent done for you. Right before I say peace out, I just want to clarify these templates are meant to give you a boost and a head start and help you start creating content. But overall, you want to shift away from these and start coming up with your own unique ideas. That's pretty much it. Just want to clarify. Peace out.